Hey guys, it's Danny. Now, not too long ago, I was on Instagram and I was asking you guys what type of recipes you would want to see before the summer is up. And I was surprised to see how many of you all wanted lemonade. So for today's quick bite, I am showing you how to make one of my personal favorite lemonades, a clean and delicious cucumber mint lemonade. Now this lemonade is so yummy and it could not be any easier to make. All you need is two cups of fresh squeezed lemon juice, two chopped up English cucumbers. Those are the cucumbers that don't have the big seeds in the middle. One and a half cups of fresh mint leaves, three quarter cups of honey, and then four cups of filtered water. And then into my blender goes the lemon juice, the cucumbers, those mint leaves, and the honey. Then I'm just gonna pop on the lid and let that go for about 30 seconds or so. You really want to pulverize all of those ingredients so we can extract as much of the flavor as possible. Then I just take a fine mesh strainer and I lay it right on top of this spouted cup I have. Makes it easy for pouring. And then slowly pour the lemonade through the strainer and you'll see that all of the mint and the cucumbers will get caught in the strainer and that beautiful bright fresh lemonade will all drip to the bottom. Now, as of right now, this is like a lemonade concentrate. It is really strong and concentrated in flavor. So what I like to do is transfer this into a pitcher and then I add in four cups of filtered water. And this is exactly how I store it in my refrigerator. And then the next time I want a glass of lemonade, I just fill up my cup with some ice and pour. This lemonade is so good. I love the combination of the refreshing cucumber and mint paired with those tart bright lemons. You guys have got to try this one. And just for the record, my kids sold this very lemonade right outside my house at their very first lemonade stand for 50 cents a cup, which is a great deal for this lemonade. And I gotta tell you, there was not a person in the neighborhood that was disappointed. So you have to try it, and when you do, remember, snap a picture and then tag me on Instagram and on Facebook so I can see all the deliciousness that you are whipping up in your very own kitchens. And if you wanna print this recipe or any of my recipes, head on over to cleananddelicious.com. And hey, don't forget to like this video and subscribe. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I'm Danny Spees. I'll see you next time with some more clean and deliciousness. Cheers. Mmm.